Mourners are coming from far and wide to pay their respects. Our Jim Donovan spent the day outside Windsor Castle as the world remembers the British monarch. It's been just about 36 hours since Buckingham Palace announced the death of Queen Elizabeth II. Here at Windsor Castle, thousands of people came out today to pay their respects, placing bouquets and letters on the gates outside of the castle. But it's also a period of extreme activity here as hundreds of thousands, if not millions of people, are expected to come out for her funeral. Here outside of the castle gates, you'll notice a lot of uh, machinery and construction equipment. Workers are now putting together the stages for the international media. Thousands of them are arriving uh, over the next few days uh, to be able to broadcast for the 10 days of mourning as well as for the official funeral services here at uh, Windsor Castle. So a lot of activity. The somber mood that we saw yesterday has lightened a little bit, um, but still uh, definitely a, a somber tone to a certain extent here in England. Reporting from uh, Windsor Castle, I'm Jim Donovan, CBS3 Eyewitness News. And we will provide continuing coverage as the world remembers the Queen. If you missed any of our stories, you can find them all at CBSPhiladelphia.com.